Today we're taking a look at the New York Knicks vs New Orleans Pelicans match, which is happening on Sunday, April 18th, 2021, and giving you my betting tips and predictions in general on this game. Welcome back to High Stakes, let's get straight into it. Also, don't forget to subscribe to get notified as soon as we release these sport prediction videos. One of these days we'll see the Brooklyn Nets big three on the floor playing basketball together, but it won't be Sunday against the Miami Heat. The 38-18 Nets take on the 28-28 Miami Heat Sunday in Miami. The Nets have beaten the Heat twice already this year in a back-to-back -back on January 23rd and January 25th in Brooklyn. The Brooklyn Nets, who have won twice in their last four outings, received a considerable blow recently when veteran Lamarcus Aldridge announced his retirement from the league. Nevertheless, they returned to winning ways against the Charlotte Hornets in their last game, with three players scoring at least 20 points. The Miami Heat, meanwhile, have lost three straight games on the road. They have shown a lack of defensive intensity, with Jimmy Butler opining that his team got complacent against the Minnesota Timberwolves. Despite five players scoring in double digits, with Butler registering a near triple-double, the Miami Heat slumped to a 111-119 reverse against the Timberwolves. So here is my first betting suggestion for that game. Because they have been so wildly inconsistent this season, the Heat have been a very hard team to figure out. They have been terrible against the spread this year, going 22-32 against the spread overall and 10-17-1 at home ATS. Meanwhile, they face a Nets team that is getting healthy. Durant is back and looks good and Irving is playing well, not to mention their role players, who have stepped up. They are still waiting on Harden to return, but even without him, they are an elite team. The Brooklyn Nets are the clear favorites to win this game, considering the recent form of Kevin Durant and Kyrie Irving. The Miami Heat are coming off a loss to the Minnesota Timberwolves, while the surging Brooklyn Nets return to winning ways against the Charlotte Hornets. My first betting advice for that game is to pick Brooklyn Nets. The Brooklyn Nets finally have Kevin Durant back in the fold, joining Kyrie Irving, while both are prone to take days off here and there for whatever reason, I'm sure they're all good ones, they are basically healthy. But they remind me of the Clippers last year, who took a lot of time off during the regular season last year then fell flat in the playoffs. We'll see. The Nets now stand at 38-18, just a game behind the first place Sixers in the Eastern Conference. The Brooklyn Nets produced a stellar offensive performance in their last outing, among six players who tallied double-digit point hauls, Joe Harris registered 26, while Kevin Durant had 25 points and 11 assists. Harris had a hugely impressive shooting night, as he got 8 of his 12 2-point and 6 of his 9 3-point attempts on target. Following Aldridge's retirement, DeAndre Jordan is sharing minutes with Claxton at the set. The Brooklyn Nets have many players out, with Harden, who is sidelined with a hamstring injury joining Spencer Dinwiddie, Chris Chiazza, and Tyler Johnson in the injury list. Meanwhile, Blake Griffin and Landry Shaman have been the standout players off the bench. Kevin Durant has been his usual self since his return. The Brooklyn Nets sorely missed him when they took on the Philadelphia 76ers, as Joel Embiid took over the game. Durant's presence means that the Brooklyn Nets will fancy a win against any opposition as the player looks to get back into the conversation for the MVP award this season. The Nets are coming off a 130-115 win over Charlotte Friday. Joe Harris led the Nets with 26 points with six three-pointers. Kevin Durant added 25 points and 11 rebounds while Landry Shamit tossed in 20 points off the bench. Kyrie Irving added 12 points with 6 assists and 3 steals. James Harden remains out until late April. The Nets also lost LaMarcus Aldridge, who abruptly retired this week due to an irregular heartbeat. Brooklyn Nets predicted lineup. Point guard, Kyrie Irving. Shooting guard, Joe Harris. Small forward, Kevin Durant. Power forward, Jeff Green. Center, DeAndre Jordan. The Miami Heat are the NBA's version of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. 
They look great sometimes and terrible at other times. Now they are in their Mr. Hyde phase, where they look terrible. The Heat have lost three straight games and plummeted to 28 to 28. They are 1.5 games behind the sixth place Knicks and only a half a game ahead of Charlotte. The Miami Heat have had two difficult nights defensively despite some good individual performances. Jimmy Butler has produced 21.9 points and is shooting at over 55% in recent weeks, while Bam Adebayo is averaging 19 points and 9.2 rebounds per outing this campaign. Joran Dragic produced 15 points in the Miami Heat's last game, while Trevor Ariza bagged 21. Meanwhile, Victor Oladipo remains out, while Andre Iguodala is listed as questionable for this game due to a hip injury. Nevertheless, the Heat are 7th in the Eastern Conference and very much in the reckoning for the playoffs. Jimmy Butler has been in brilliant shooting form in recent weeks and has been a huge presence at both ends of the court. Butler has forged a great partnership with the ever-impressive Bam Adebayo, who is the Miami Heat's second most prolific scorer this season. Butler leads the team in assists and points scored while Adebayo is averaging 9.2 rebounds per game. They were embarrassed on Friday, losing to the lowly Minnesota Timberwolves, 119-111. The Heat were beat in nearly every aspect of the game by the league's worst team. Jimmy Butler did his part with 30 points, 10 rebounds, 8 assists, and 3 steals but it wasn't a moth. Trevor Ariza added 21 points and 7 rebounds while Bam Adebayo chipped in with 17 points. Victor Oladipo and Andre Iguodala remain questionable for the Heat. Miami Heat predicted lineup. Point guard, Kendrick Nunn. Shooting guard, Duncan Robinson. Small forward, Trevor Ariza. Power forward, Jimmy Butler. Center, Bam Adebayo. So here is my second betting suggestion for that game. The Brooklyn Nets are still winning games despite not being fully healthy, and they're shooting 51.5% from the field in their last five games. The Miami Heat still have consistency issues, they lost to the Timberwolves on Friday, and they're losing their last five games by an average of six points while not playing much defense. Jimmy Butler called his team soft after the loss to Minnesota, the Nets are 11-4 ATS in their last 15 road games and 4-1 ATS in their last 5 games overall. The Heat are 2-6 ATS in their last 8 home games and 1-5 ATS in their last 6 games overall. The over is 5-1 in Nets last 6 overall. The over is 6-2 in Heat last 8 overall. The Nets are 4-1-1 ATS in the last six meetings in Miami and 5-1 ATS in the last six meetings. The Brooklyn Nets look for a win after winning 10 of their last 14 games. The Brooklyn Nets are averaging 119 points on 49.5% shooting and allowing 114.3 points on 46.3% shooting. Kevin Durant is averaging 28.1 points and 5.4 assists while Kyrie Irving is averaging 27.5 points and 4.8 rebounds. James Harden is the third double-digit scorer and Joe Harris is dishing 1.8 assists. The Brooklyn Nets are shooting 39.1% from beyond the arc and 80.6% from the free throw line. The Brooklyn Nets are allowing 36.5% shooting from deep and are grabbing 44.3 rebounds per game. My second betting advice for that game is to pick under. Now for some stats and trends. Nets are 6-1 ATS in their last 7 road games versus a team with a winning home record. Nets are 4-1 ATS in their last 5 after scoring 100 points or more in their previous game. Nets are 4-1 ATS in their last 5 games overall. Heat are 0-5 ATS in their last 5 home games versus a team with a winning road record. Heat are 0-4 ATS in their last 4 games versus a team with a winning percent above .600. Good luck to all of you. That's it for this video. Stay tuned and stay safe for the next betting tips and advice.